Hi there, today I want to show you a cool piece of functionality that's available in D365 Business Central, and that is the inventory adjustment feature. So I'm going to go to my item list. This piece of functionality is available in any view. So if I go to my list view, this is where you'll find it on the ellipses, and it's adjust inventory, or In the tile view, again, it's available on the ellipses. And of course, in the tall tiles, it's available as well. So what does it do? So if you find that you have a discrepancy, you can actually make an inventory adjustment right from the screen rather than having to go to an item journal. And the way you do that is you just click on the ellipses and you choose adjust inventory. And what you do is, depending on which location you found the anomaly in and you want to make the adjustment, you go to that location. Mine is, I, I don't really use my locations, so I just have a blank location. And what I'm going to do now is just make that adjustment and click OK. Once it's completed the adjustments, you'll be able to see that in the item ledger. So if I drill into my quantity on hand, I see the negative adjustment for the quantity that I adjusted. And if I drill into my cost amount over here, I can actually look at the GL entries associated with this transaction. And here I'm seeing the inventory adjustment account. And of course, I'm seeing my inventory account, which is resale items in this case. So it does everything properly on the back end as far as the GL is concerned, but it's a very, very simplified process for just making quick adjustments in lieu of doing a, an entire physical inventory or an item journal. Thank you very much. I hope that was helpful. Thanks for watching this Archer Point video. If you found it helpful, make sure to check out our website and blog at www.archerpoint.com. Additionally, if you have any questions regarding our products, services, or information in this video, feel free to email us at info at archerpoint.com. Thanks.